Oh, she had. While we were at Fishing Point, we also celebrated our one-year bus life anniversary. Yeah. I don't think we did anything besides. We drank our champagne, our yeah. bottle of you wine. You drank the champagne and got drunk as usual. Oh, we didn't get drunk. We never get drunk. No, we get a little bit tipsy, but we never get drunk. Hangover mm. sucked too much. That's what you saying you help out. <laughs> and more important things to do um yeah so we celebrated one year in a bus we drank our bus warming bottle of wine that was yeah. a gift from our brother and sister-in-law yeah or tom's brother and his sister-in-law whatever well, we would have been her thanks kelly thanks kelly for the lovely <laughs> bottle of wine <laughs> <laughs> poor will he gets picked on all the time um and I think we just were all a bit surprised at how easy it is to get stuck back in the work life routine. Yeah. The rut. Like we were parked there for the four months. Yeah. We were just working and doing things. Like, I mean, stop fiddling with things while we're on a podcast. Ali's playing with a cactus. Like she's holding a cactus while we're on a podcast. So next minute we're just going to hear, ow, I have wrinkles <laughs> in my finger. I've never said that. I don't know about that. Well, um, besides the time that I like cactus in my foot, but yeah, so don't play with the cactus when we're doing a podcast. Um, serious stuff here, Ali. Uh, the work life rut right, too too very easy to get stuck back yeah. into, and we weren't even doing things on our day off. Like we were just hanging out as if we were in a house for a yeah. bit, and we just had to say to ourselves, like, get your shit in gear. Like we're living this amazing life. Don't just fall back in the rut. It's so so easy because it's the rut. That's the rut. The debt's the right thing. Yeah, we don't have debt now. It's debt that gets you in the rut. You think, oh, yeah, I'll just buy this, and next thing you got a loan for 25 years, yeah. or you got a car loan for six years. But it was just so easy to get back into the routine, wasn't it? Go to work. Oh, not really. I told the lady I was working for, I didn't do well. I only did three days a week. I didn't want any more. No, well, and I done two or three days a week, and I didn't really want any more either. But it's just, we just got in a routine, in a rut, so, so quickly. And then, so we were sort of just doing the same thing, same thing, work, sport, sleep, and we are doing it in a beautiful location, but we weren't really living bus life to the max there for a while. No. So um, then we went, we decided we had to do, get back to doing exploring day. So on our day off, at least once a week, we had to go and do something. Yeah. Which was good. And I think it's something we've got to keep reminding ourselves when we're in these periods where we're parked up and working and putting some money in the bank that we've got to keep that lifestyle going a bit because yeah. it's super easy just to go back to the normal grind that everyone's conditioned to be in so on one of our exploring days we went to ghosties beach in 